Okay, so I just got the cutest little guinea pig. And as I was doing research on what to feed guinea pigs, one of the things they said that they like and that's good for them is zucchini. Well, my guinea pig didn't like zucchini. I don't like zucchini, but I was like, I got to eat it because I bought it. So actually, I had recent, like a year or two ago, purchased one of these. It's called a spiralizer. And so I still had it. And I was like, all right, so I'm going to spiralize my zucchini. And then I put, so I spiralized three zucchinis. And then I put six eggs um, and two whole eggs. So six egg whites, sorry. Two, six egg whites two whole eggs and I mean I I have it just looks amazing and I put a hickory smoke on it and I'm going to put it into my lettuce leaf and I'm gonna eat it and I will show you what it looks okay, like. Okay so now what I'm doing is I'm gonna put some of the wonderful zucchini noodles and my eggs into my romaine lettuce. I think you've seen this a few times but this is a new dish but it's such a fun way to eat your food. So let me see what it tastes like. Ooh, <laughs> that's actually really good. I think a lot of it is the hickory spice that I added to it. Cause again, as I said, I am not a huge zucchini fan lover, but it's kind of cool cause it actually tastes better once you kind of brown it. Oh, it's good. It's, <laughs> it's really good. So I hope you try it and it makes a wonderful dinner. All right. Enjoy. Hey, you guys, this is Deborah Stern from Food Print for Life and my YouTube channel. What I would love is your support in subscribing to my YouTube channel to help me out. It's for free, doesn't cost a thing. All you have to do is push that button that says subscribe. I think it's over there or over there, somewhere over there. <laughs> and you can also go to my website, which is foodprintforlife.com. And I have it written on most of my videos. Um, and you can see all the services that I offer if you are interested. I love questions, I love comments, um, I do FaceTime, I do many, many aspects in terms of different media, um, mediums for especially now, you know, that people are stuck at home. I know how important it is to make sure that we're keeping healthy and that we're keeping safe and that we're keeping moving and that we have good recipe ideas that are healthy and that are going to keep us so that we're not at the end of this whole thing going, ah, why didn't I start earlier? <laughs> so um, please check it out. I'd love for you to subscribe, as I said, and um, check out my website, foodprintforlife.com. Uh, you can always email me too at foodprintforlife at gmail.com. Thank you so much.